Rui Lopez opening, Berlin defense, 4.d3. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered Black in the middle game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. A typical answer is e5, which builds a position in the middle, controls d4, and frees up the queen and bishop on the dark square. The move nf3 advances the knight toward the center, engages the e5 piece in combat, and sets up a castle. Nc6 defends the pawn on e5, advances the knight toward the center, and scans the d4 square. The Rui Lopez opening develops the bishop to immediately attack the knight on c6, the lone defender of the e5 pawn. Nf6 advances the knight and engages in an attack on the exposed e4 pawn. d3 protects the e4 pawn and allows the dark squared bishop to develop. It is the last book move. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is best. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. It is excellent. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is quite good. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. This strikes the opponent's bishop. It is ideal. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. That's good. A very strong play. It is excellent. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This provides an equal exchange of parts. The pawns in front of the king could potentially double as a result. It is ideal. This threatens to win a pawn. This prevents the opponent from being able to double the pawns in front of the king. It is good. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. This prevents the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is best. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. It is a fair deal after all captures. That's good. This is an equal trade. It is best. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. This reveals an attack on a pawn. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. From a prior move, recaptures. It is ideal. This is the only good move. This threatens to fork pieces. It is a great move. White had the advantage at first, but now they are in the lead. It is incorrect. This misses a fantastic but elusive move. It is incorrect. This threatens to reveal an attack on a pawn. This allows the opponent to fork pieces. It is a mistake. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This defends the attacked pawn. This threatens to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This attacks a knight and gains a tempo when the knight retreats. That's good. This is how you take down a rook. 
it is ideal. This moves the queen to safety. It is excellent. This comes in several sections. It is ideal. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is excellent. This succeeds in capturing a helpless rook. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is quite good. Right on target. It is best. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered black in the middle game. 